wow, really? Really? <laughs> wow. I mean, she's not messing around. Hey guys, so uh, it's been a while since I've been home. I'm gonna give you an update on all of my tanks here. We're also gonna teach my cousin how to feed all of my different fish because the YouTube algorithm loves feedings. Before we do that, you might be wondering, George, George, man, how, how's your summer going? Some lows, this video was supposed to come out last week before I left for Florida, but I accidentally dropped my hard drive, so we couldn't get all the footage until now. Last week, I celebrated my birthday. Uh, I turned 22. Didn't really know what to do, so I went skydiving. Funniest part about that was I didn't tell my younger brother what we were doing until we got there. He was really nervous. All right, so I'm gonna get, get in here. Yeah, I'm gonna get in this. Yeah. You gotta lift it up so they can see me. Oh, no, go get another chair then. They can't see you. YouTube algorithm loves Yanni. What's up, <laughs> y'all? The algorithm definitely has a crush on you, though. I know. Well, I mean, yeah. <laughs> Uh, tell, tell them about skydiving. Tell them about skydiving. So what happened? Skydiving was like pretty sick. What else did we do, Yanni? Uh, Wait, we have to like fall. No, we're not. We're not doing that. Also, no, dude, that's a big thing. People love when you fall. Yeah. No, you can fall. All right, you're I'll done. Taking the reins back on this one. We also hung out with the gingerbread twins. They taught me how to ride a dirt bike. Oh, let's see. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I almost went straight into their family room. I've been hanging out with Nick and Chris a lot. Uh, besides visiting their fish store over in Naperville, they also came over the other day and finally helped me finish setting up my fish room. Chris helped me put all of my artwork up on the walls. Dude, that is a very big boy. All right, now is one of the most painful things we're gonna do. We're gonna have to put my Apex system up. I think we're gonna put it on this wall, right above this tank. Nick actually installed a full RODI mixing station for me, which is so nice. Like, bro, when you don't have to worry about flooding your dorm room's bathroom anymore, to my RLAs, I'm sorry about that again. But yeah, now I have unlimited water to do water changes, which, I mean, I've just been dishing out water changes, honestly, like, whenever I want. I just dish them out, like, water change here, water change there. Check out my green spotted puffers. Hey, little guys. Okay, they have grown like crazy. I've been feeding these guys a ton of clams. You guys are probably pretty hungry, aren't you? All right, well, before I can feed you guys, I've been feeding you so much that you, you're living in filth. So I'm gonna do a water change on this tank. Did you see all these empty shells? I'm gonna take these out. We've got a shell graveyard here. One last thing, we're also going to change the filter. Because these fish eat so much, the tank actually gets pretty dirty. This is the new one. This is the old one, look. All right, so get this, guys. Uh, you guys have been sending me graduation gifts, but they're not for me. So I got this one yesterday. It's for my clown fish. I just think it's crazy that my fish are getting graduation gifts. Well, I mean, it is 2019, so. All right, guys, so you ready to open up your gift? Oh, that's incredible. So they took the limited edition aqua shell shirt from Dallas and turned it into a pillow. Yeah, we'll put it right behind you here. How does that feel? All right, sweet, Woo. love gifts. All right guys, now that I've done some water changes, changed out the filter sponges, I mean, the only thing that's really left is we need to prepare the person who's gonna be taking care of these tanks while we're gone, which I'm hoping Big George can do because I don't know if mom and dad are gonna be around. Do you trust Big George though? Uh, that's exactly why we need to go teach him how to feed all the fish. We're going upstairs to get the food. I keep it in my freezer in the kitchen because that freezer is better than the one down here. It's always best to keep your food as frozen as possible to help maintain that nutritional value. You know what day it's today? Taco Tuesday! Taco Tuesday! Taco Tuesday! Don't you think three scoops is a little overboard? No, it's not because if I scream and you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Yay! Yo, George, while you're over by the freezer, can you yeah. also get the fish food? Why? Um, I was hoping that you could feed my fish while we're at Monster Fish Bash this weekend. I'm happy to feed your fish. I really will. I'll do the best that I can. This okay. is where we keep the fish food. So we take these two out. 
All right. All right, so this is the frozen mysis. Basically, you're just gonna pop one of these into the can. That. Okay. Fight the urge to actually eat it yourself, okay? <laughs> you never know. <laughs> Half-shelled clams. Okay. So, you're gonna take one of these, and you're also gonna put it in there. All right, let's go feed the fish. All right. Wait, what number is that on the McDonald's menu? I think it was a seven. Filet of fish. Give me back that filet of fish. Okay, so what you're gonna do, you're gonna take these tongs, you're gonna give the clownfish just a, like a couple pieces of that mysis. So you're that's perfect. That's okay. like a piece or two. Dump it in there? Yeah. Oh. No clowning around here. <laughs> so is that all I do for these guys? Yeah, for those, that, that's okay. it. It's once a day. Once a day. Yo, guys, are you okay with someone else feeding you? Hold on, they wanna check you out first. You gotta put your finger in there just so they can give you like some kisses. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> it's like nibble, nibble. Nibble. You're gonna take that clam. These guys eat clams? Yeah. I didn't know that. Wow. It helps trim their beaks. You're gonna throw this in there and they're gonna go beast mode on it. You just take the clam and you throw it in there and you wait until they know. Oh, oh wow. That is cool how they just like nose dive to it. That's Kirby, Furby, and uh, Fergie. Mm -hmm. So this is Pegasus and Poseidon. Oh, this. there it is. Yeah, yeah. right there. So there's one and then there's the other. You're gonna grab some of that Mysis. There's a nice big chunk. Yeah, you'll come out into the open and you just put it right in front of them. Oh, wow, Ooh. Yeah, and he snaps on it. Boom. Or I just fed Poseidon, you're gonna do Pegasus. Uh, can you tell them apart? Yeah, one's bigger. One's the male and one's technically the female. Oh, Wait. do you know that males carry the babies? I do. Yeah, that's really uh, cool. Like you. Yeah. <laughs> Get to my belly. My belly! Here goes. Oh, that's a big chunk. Food. What? What? Oh, wow. That's like a quick snap. Like snap, snap, snap. All right, go for the yeah, other yeah, one. The big one's in the back. Oh. What's his name? Pegasus. Pegasus. Yeah, he's trying to show off, trying to get you a zoo, so I'll look at you. Ah. There. That's awesome. This looks like a fire hazard. Yeah, so the gingerbread twins, they helped me yeah. do everything, but they're coming back next week to they're, do They're really nice guys. They actually became friends with them on Facebook. Really? Yeah. Do awesome. you add them on LinkedIn? Hey, yeah, no. man. How about you stay on topic? All right, we're shooting a video. Hey, yes. Let's feed the monster. Okay. So he's in here. Johnny, you want to get him out of here? Whole piece? No. Yeah. I mean, that's fine. For real? Yeah. What's his name? Hulk. 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 Smash. There he goes. There he goes. Oh, wow. oh my God. He's a beast. Dude, he chowed on that. <laughs> And then I know how powerful he is, so I was like, oh, what do I do? Should I let go? And I, I'm really bad with chopsticks. <laughs> <laughs> Regardless of the camera, I thought that was awesome. Yeah, dude. Yeah, Why don't you take him out on a date since you're so obsessed with him? Okay, so right. then we're going to give that to uh, oh, the, the blue crap. It's actually a crayfish. Oh, a crayfish. Yeah. Oh, he cray. cray, cray. She's out and about right now. This is a uh, Smurfette. All right, so it's the same thing. You're going to put it in front of her. She doesn't bite, does she? Oh. Wow, really? Really? <laughs> wow. I mean, she's not messing around. She might be attracted to you, George. You never know. I mean, look at me. <laughs> <laughs> when you're done feeding her, yeah. you're gonna wanna put this lid on the tank because she can actually escape. She can crawl out of the tank and she's done it for, before. Like for real? Yeah, you gotta make sure you take this lid. You gotta put it all the way over here because what she can do is she can climb up on this side. On this side, she has nothing to climb up on. So you just put it over there and she'll be good. She'll be good, okay. That's, that's cool, all right, let's feed her. Now do I let go? Whenever she's, she's gonna grab it from you eventually. Oh, there she goes again. Yeah, so crayfish will eat, I mean, a lot of different things. Sometimes you give them sinking pellets, but since you're already gonna be feeding all of these other guys mysis, it's okay. Whatever food you have left, since these are just little baby nano fish, you're gonna yeah. give it to them. They're called cardinal tetras. Oh, oh, nice. Look at that. Oh. You know, we got this green screen right here. Uh, if you stand in front of it, yeah. we can make you feed any animal in the world. Are you serious? Yeah. All right, all right yeah. go. What are you feeding right now? I'm feeding uh, hammer shark. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here comes the beluga whale. He's so cute until he plummets. I don't, I'm not feeling the green screen. I don't know. <laughs> How do I get rid of this? Do I just- All right, so the leftovers, it? yeah, come over here. Okay. Leftovers, you just throw in the sink. You wash it down. Okay. Never dump all that water into the tank because that'll just make it super dirty. George, that's pretty much it. All you gotta do is do that once a day for the entire weekend and the fish will be fine. Will do. Yeah, I'm sure they're gonna get even stronger while you're gone because I feed well.
<laughs> Remember to keep those nitrates low. <laughs> George, out.